you have detected some non compliance with laws and regulations during the course of audit as an auditor what procedures will you perform the first step is to obtain knowledge of non compliance you should op also obtain knowledge of the circumstances in which such non compliance has occurred now if there is any non compliance there will be some consequence for example some fine penalty may be levied on company or non financial consequences like attachment of property etc may arise as an auditor you should verify the consequences which arise because of non compliance further you should verify whether the going concern assumption is affected now this is very important some non compliances are so material that a order is passed by the government to wind off the company you should communicate such non compliance to management and also those charged with governance further verify whether the non compliance is material enough to affect the true and fair view if it affects the true and fair view you should consider qualifying your report now you should ask me a question when going concern assumption is vitiated or affected by a non compliance with laws and regulation let us take an example sanlu corporation was number 1 chinese dairy now what they did is they mix melamine in baby milk powder because of mixture of melamine a lot of newborn babies died within weeks of consumption of such contaminated milk now when the matter was revealed the chinese government ordered the company's business to be wind off now there's a non compliance melamine is a chemical which is banned to be mixed in milk products now when this was done it was detected the business is wind off therefore the first step which auditor should take is to obtain an understanding of the non compliance and the consequences which may arise because of such non compliance consider reporting to management consider the effect on your own audit report